Hello my good friend, Devin here, and today I'm going to review a movie from 2004, and that is The Punisher. Now the plot of this movie is where this guy named Frank Castle, played by Thomas Jane, is on a vacation one day with his family, and there his fam his wife and kids are killed by this guy named Howard Saint, played by John Travolta, and because he blames the death of his son on him, so the Punisher or, or Frank in this case uh, has to decides to get revenge on Howard and kill him. So, yeah, the plot's easy as that. <laughs> um, this movie I thought was really underrated. People are varied on this movie. They either love it or hate it. Me, personally, I love it. Yeah, the Punisher is a pretty interesting Marvel character. Um, yeah, this movie definitely was a good adaptation of him. There was also an adaptation in 1989 with uh, Dolph Lundgren, which I've never seen, but I don't know if it's worth a watch or not, but I don't know. I'll, maybe I'll decide for myself. But I thought this was a pretty enjoyable film. The acting is great. I thought John Travolta was like a really good villain. And it's hard to believe, yeah, the guy from Greece plays a villain in a Marvel movie. Yeah, well, true, he was in Pulp Fiction, but that's besides the point. And Thomas Jane, I thought, did, was a really awesome Punisher. The action's really good. This is definitely not a movie to show kids, though. I mean, the action in this isn't as, as intense as Logan or Blade or, heck, even Deadpool, which was more of a comedy, had more intense action than this. But it's still not a movie for kids, like, there's a lot of F-bombs and even some nudity here and there, but this is a really good movie, and especially there's this one scene that it's it was cracking me up the whole time. It's where uh, the Punisher was interrogating this guy, and he, and he is torturing him, and he was hanging him down, and you think he's going to use a blowtorch, but he keeps rubbing a popsicle on him, and since it's so cold, he's like, ah, ah. It cracks me up. And it actually was from the comics. That's humor in a superhero movie done right, Disney. Comic accurate. But yeah, this movie was... I thought it was really underrated. I actually think it deserves more attention. I think it's a pretty dang good movie. Is it amazing? No. But it's fun. It's enjoyable if you're in the mood for some good over-the-top action, it'll be up your alley, and especially if you love comic book movies, so that's my review of The Punisher. See you next time.